Now I am going to show you how to clamp a specimen. I will be talking about bad and good clamping. When you clamp a specimen, you should first think about this alignment in this direction and also with respect to the middle of the surface of the clamping surfaces and also how deep it is inside the clamping surfaces. The tabs are designed to have the same size as the clamping surfaces. Let's see how it works when it is good clamping. As you can see here, the flat surfaces they are parallel. And let's see what happens when it is bad clamping. And here you can see that the flat surfaces they are not parallel anymore. And this is bad because it has a risk that your specimen can slide when it is uh, loaded under tension. And also it can be under compression before any test starts and this compression can lead to early damage. And finally if you open the grips and we have a look to the tabs, you see the, the difference in the color. This indicates that the pressure was applied only at the end of the taps.